So what is sand and why is it used? Sand is the main component of the majority of top dressing and construction materials that are used for sports mm -hmm. turf and amenity grass turf surfaces. Sand can be composed of different materials with quartz being the most well known and most common. Sand is used to improve the mechanical conditions of soil, particularly heavy soils. In this case, having sand between clays, silt and organic matter helps improve the texture and immediate surface drainage if the correct sand is used. So what are the benefits of sand? It provides good drainage, it warms and cools much quicker than loam or clay soils, lighter and easier to cultivate, provide good soil aeration, provide poor channels for root development, reduce thatch content, protects surface roots from wind and temperature changes, quickly works into surfaces and improves surface smoothness. So what are the constraints of sand then? It can produce unstable surfaces that are prone to erosion, dries out and drains much quicker than clay or loam soils, can produce hydrophobic dry spots, nutrients tend to leach through the sands leading to deficiencies and imbalances, layering issues from using different sands over the years. There's also many different particle sizes broken down into five categories, with each category being half of the previous particle size with fine, medium and coarse being the most commonly used for turf grass. Very coarse sands are 1 to 2 mm, coarse sands are 0.5 mm to 1 mm, medium sands 0.25 to 0.5 mm, fine sands 0.125 to 0.25 mm and very fine sands 0.0625 to 0.125 mm. Sands can also be categorised according to their roundness and severity. These include angular, subangular, subrounded, rounded, and well rounded, as seen in this graph. And that is a very quick rundown on sand. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe, and you can visit us at internationalgreenkeepers.com.